Hello everyone, welcome to my other video about Mid Journey Prompt Generator. This tool is free and very powerful. With just one click, you can generate a single prompt or more than 200 prompts. If you haven't seen my other video about Mid Journey, please check the description. Let's have a look at the website first. So here you have an option to click on this prompt builder. Click on this. You can click to get this prompter. Once you click on this, you can save this file in your Google Drive. Once you have this Excel file, let's go ahead and start filling and create our prompt. So in the main idea, I will go ahead with castle on the mountain. Here you have an option to provide weight as well. Then secondary subject if you have anything, but I don't have anything, so I'll leave that. If you don't want to include anything in your prompt or image, you can provide here. So I have given like text and you have stylized quality, chaos, seed and other things. So for again seed, you can put a random number, right? 433. Uh, three and let's go with uh, then you have aspect ratio again you have predefined a lot of options here but for my image i'll go with 16 is to 9 again you have medium here what kind of medium you want for your part uh, like for your image you know pop art style 3d rendering animation comic book digital art so i'll go with digital art here then you have camera setting here you can always go with uh, you know different camera setting but since it is a wide uh, angle photo i'll go with uh, uh, 360 degree or sorry panorama view and lighting option i'll go with cinematic lighting but again there are lots of uh, option for lights available here you can select based on your requirement okay if you want any specific color to be part of your image you can select here but i am not looking for anything specific so i'll leave that blank then you have a descriptor here so like for my image i want it to be a dream like and descriptor two as well you can provide here so i'm going with hyper realistic you have artist option but there is nothing specific i'm looking for so i'll leave that if you want your image to have a look uh, like in based on some film you can select here i have selected allies in wonderland but there are a lot of uh, you know options are available here in the drop down uh, same goes with the game right once you select all the options here you will have the prompt ready so you can just go ahead, copy this prompt, go to your Discord and provide your prompt. Okay, so let's wait for the image and we'll come back. The first set of image is ready here. Let's have a look at them. So you can see here, like, you know, we have given a theme of Alice in Wonderland, right? Based on that, we are able to get uh, that images here. And these images are really cool. So let's consider that you have the idea, but you don't know what to fill here. So for that, you have this cluster option, which you can select from here. So let's go here. You have a lot of predefined cluster, which you can select. I'm going with super detail, keeping my main idea as castle on the mountain. Once you select this, your prompt will be updated. So let's take this prompt and hit. So our image is ready. And you can see here, uh, we are able to get this image. And I have changed the prompt to dream alike, okay? and i'm able to generate images like this so you can see here you know you can easily try and test multiple options with this uh, prompt builder there is something more amazing in this tool that is called batcher so what it does it it can generate more than 200 prompts in a go so you will keep the main idea here you can select aspect ratio. so once you select this what it will do is it will take your main idea and it will add all the option which is available as a part of checkbox you know uh, as an aspect ratio and it goes for the same so if you want to incorporate all the mediums it will just add single medium in different different uh, prompt okay same goes for camera lighting and other so here what i have done is i have you chosen lighting as different options so you'll see here castle on mountain panorama because i have kept camera as set that so it will give that in all the prompt and different lighting option because i have chosen that so ambient lighting backlighting backlight uh, campfire, candlelight, and other so. Uh, for descriptor, I have selected as hyper realistic and film as uh, Harry Potter. So what we can do here is we can just select few from this and test how the images are coming. Let's have a look at the image which I generated using a batch prompt. So you can see here it has a you know Harry Potter theme. In this, we have different kind of lighting. Again here, the color is different. Uh, they have added little bit of redness and cinematic view here. And in, in this image, we have this golden signing rays here. So you don't have to write multiple prompts, you know, you just have to use this batch 
and it will write a prompt for you and you can try and test whatever looks good you can always reroll those those prompt and uh, generate multiple images if you found this tutorial helpful and informative please give it a like and consider subscribing to my channel if you have any suggestions please leave a comment below thanks for watching